Hello guys, Max from Muay Thai High here. I have a sparring video to share with you guys today and I will be commentating through the video. Please like, subscribe and share if you find this interesting and don't forget to click the bell to receive future updates from the channel. So to give a little bit of context, uh, my student name is Stuart. He's been trained for two years, one year with me. But he is a pretty experienced martial artist. He has done judo, karate, and Krav Maga before. And he is about 6'4 and 185 pounds. You want to sit rounds or what do you want to do? Um, that uh, yeah, is his worst, not mine. <laughs> um, I am about 5'8, 5'9 on a good day. And I weigh about 150. And I have been training for six years. The rounds were two minute long with one minute break. Uh, anything to the face is light, just touches. Uh, decent power to the body and leg. And we try to focus more on movement, uh, volumes, speed, faint, rather than power. So I've been trying to teach Stuart how to fight long and keep me at a distance where I can't really come in. Um, so you can see that he's working mostly his jab, cross, uh, teep, inside low kick and perhaps uh, outside low kick as well. And he has quite a few tricks that uh, he came up on his own to I guess get angles like the southpaw angles. And he's quite successful with it, but he uh, sometimes has a tendency to not commit to a shot. Um, probably because he's so big, he's worried about hurting me. Uh, uppercut right hand, kick to the head. I think what I'm trying to do here is trying to pick up the pace a little bit, because he was kind of outpacing me with volume, so I kind of just have to catch up and landing more shots here. Oh, nice right hand. But the the technique could be kind of <laughs> tightened up a little bit. <laughs> uh, okay. Nice left kick. Okay, jab cross. Nice. Mm, I was going for my karate sidekick feint, something that I've been recently playing around with. Superman, right kick, double right kick, nice. So I set that up with a, just like a kick to the air. Here I got really excited because like his feint was really good. Um, if Stuart has something to hit me after that feint, I will... Yeah. Uh, if he knows how to throw a spinning wheel kick, then it would be a knockout right there. This is the second round. Okay. This is the round where I hunt for body shots. <laughs> uh, catch. Oh, I should put my leg down faster. Left kick. I think here I'm trying to keep him more at my distance. I, I wasn't really trying to let him establish too much. Um, just trying to land some long kicks and teeps. Just get my range correct. Nice head kick. And I did my right hook, left kick, and body jab. Nice side kick. That was a good side kick. And then <laughs> just doing some Muay Thai stuff. Oh, Superman left, right high kick, double inside low kick, southpaw. Oh, liver. Hook jab, right hand to the body. Yeah, I think this is where I try to. I was actually trying to get him <laughs> with the body shot. Oh, right kick to the body. Yeah, I'm more bouncy, trying to go in and out more. Oh, jab. Yeah, standing southpaw is. In, in a way, it kind of gives your liver more, I feel like sometimes, because your liver is closer to your opponent. 
Uh, especially if it's like orthodox southpaw. One two one two. Oh, head movement. Leg kick. Oh, yeah. That's something that my coach taught me is using the leg kick to generate drive for like your jabs and hooks. It works pretty well. I feel like it's more of a kickboxing technique, but if you use it in the in the right moment, it can help you stop your hands. Boom, nice. One, two, uh, roll under left kick. That was what I did at the end. And here I think I was trying to... Yeah, I was really tired <laughs> from hunting the uh, body shot. So I was trying to stall and just like teep teep. <laughs> nice, he landed right there, side kick. And then here's where he goes for the X kick. Oh my god, that was nice. I need to uh, start drilling that. He countered the X kick. Uh, I mean, sorry, he countered the low kick with my with his X kick. It was crazy. I never seen it before. Um, and then here, I'm just ch touching it with my left leg. That's something that I'm quite comfortable at, and I notice I do it quite quick. So, yeah, inside low teep. Just scoring. <laughs> Yeah, he felt that one. Nice. Yeah, usually sometimes when I land the right side attack, double right kick, I like to lift my right leg up and then feint like a right hook just to get an angle for the southpaw left kick. And here, I went southpaw. I think I was, yeah, I was trying to do some karate stuff. <laughs> um, oh, nice. Yeah, if he really through that and yeah that probably might be a body kick KO then I think I was trying to establish the low kick oh nice yeah the body kick was really good this round for Stewart he landed two or three that I couldn't really respond with other than catching nice okay and that was was that third I think that was the third round this was good. I actually remember. This is the fourth. Okay. Forgot what I was doing here. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm trying to show him kind of like just stand there and bait for the guy coming in and then just meet him halfway with the teep. Because he's so tall and so long. Like, he can play that game quite well. Oh. That was a bicycle thing. <laughs> and trying to get an angle on him so that he doesn't get it on me. Nice. I'm pretty decisive with his kick. Oh, switch, switch. Left heap, right kick. And then I went southpaw. <laughs> Trying my karate stuff again. Um, the angle's not too good here. Can't really see anything. Just can't read really how what I was doing. Uh, if you want to skip forward, uh, go ahead. Wouldn't blame you. Okay, we're back. Low kick. Oh, nice teep. Oh, nice Superman. Nice tip again. I think I was just trying to close distance here. Oh, nice. Had to block that hook. Couldn't react in time. Oh. I'm trying to get an angle on him. Smartly clinch up. And then I sneak a body shot in. And I think that was it. I wanted to fix my mask and there was only like 4 seconds left. Okay. This is the 5th round. And I think I did some pretty good southpaw stuff. So body kick, teep, body kick, nice. Then inside low, side kick feint, step to get an angle, head kick, side kick. That's a new style that I'm trying to play with. Um, I feel like the offense is okay, the defense is not that good. <laughs> oh nice, yeah I can't really, I know this. I was, I was having a hard time to respond to the body kick because of the way I was standing. 
Same with that low kick. Yeah, nice. And now I was trying to like zigzag left and right. And then some low kick. Ooh, nice. That was a good spinning back kick. And yeah, oh, nice. <laughs> Yeah, another thing that I've been trying to play with is spinning stuff. I feel like used in the right time, it makes you very dynamic and very dangerous. Um, but yeah, like my whole game right here, I believe I was just trying to draw him away from the hands because I have no boxing game when I, <laughs> when I stand karate. So I was just trying to keep poking and annoying him with my, uh, with my legs. Uh, but now that I say it here, he's probably going to watch it and then just box the hell out of me next time. Um, oh, right hand, right kick, same side attack. Sneaky and fast, but then lacks power. And then, oh, I, I say self for relatively long this round. Double low kick. Yeah, the low kick is pretty, I feel like it's quite accessible. Um, just because people don't usually get low kick uh, when they stand self -pull. But yeah, that's it. That's all my sparring rounds. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you guys think of the sparring and let me know any feedbacks, comments down below in the comment section. See you next time.